Every government in the world has a secret government behind it that run the show. If you think that the president, the prime minister, you think they're doing it, they're puppets. A hundred percent puppets. They control armies, nations, governments, all the money in the world, all the richest families in the world, the Rothschilds and the Rockefellers. And I can tell you already one thing, that anyone that somehow made money within a very short span of time has to be part of it. And you think that Mike Zuckerberg owns Facebook? He's a puppet. Facebook was created for their manipulation. Same thing with YouTube, same thing with WhatsApp and Instagram and Netflix and everything. How did Netflix became so big within two years? Only with the power of the ultimate un endless money of the world. And it's much more than that. World War I was designed by them. World War II designed by them. World Reserve, which people think be be belongs to the American government. Doesn't belong to the government even. It's a private organization. NASA, CIA, the assassination of JFK, who was the first one who ever talked about it, got a bullet in his head. And needless to say, the attack on the Twin Towers, it wasn't Bin Laden. It was all one big agenda because they needed to go to Afghanistan. You know why? To put pipes in the sea. It's all one big show. We're being fooled and, and millions of Americans are cheering. We're going to a, a, a war against terror. No, you've been fooled. And you think it's different in Israel? You know that Israel was built by the Freemasons, by the way, by the Zionists. There's nothing here kosher. Who approved? Who approved the Declaration of Israel? The United Nations, of course. An organization of peace and unity and we love all. It's a terror organization built by the New World Order. And they approved the declaration of Eretz Israel. All the founders of the country of Israel are Freemasons.